All right, so I was on the I was on the uh, I wasn't sure whether I should do this or not, considering this is going to be on my um, 3DS that still needs to go in the shop. I'm waiting for a receipt from Loopy, pretty much, so that I can pay for it on PayPal before I send it to him, because uh, yeah. I, he said it was okay and that he had time to do it, but I sent him a message like a week or so ago and he has not responded back to me, so I'm still waiting for that. I might actually message him again to remind him, can he send me the PayPal, uh, the PayPal, uh, invoice so I can, uh, pay for it. <laughs> but anyways, um, no fancy backgrounds or anything because not really in the mood trying to find one for Battleground Z and Ultimate Angler, but this is gonna this video is gonna be about Battleground Z first because I know a little bit about it. I got the game originally in Japan and uh, Japan got it on like April first or second, so I played this game a little bit. Same with Ultimate Angler. I know like the gist of things and how the game kind of sort of works. Now it starts you off looking like when you first load the game up. Um, any second now. It starts off all peaceful and stuff. Gather weapons, help fellow survivors and show those zombies who's boss and yeah, there's. It doesn't look like a zombie game except for the, the message boxes. <laughs> well, and the bottom screen. But as soon as you press the A button to start it up, welcome to Bra Battleground Z. In this game, you battle hordes of zombies and rescue survivors using your wits and whatever weapons you can find. Are you ready to enter the fray? Now, if I remember correctly, how you get certain weapons like each person has a certain like thing like they like dogs or was it that or was it like for example mine is I like video games pretty sure a lot of people's is that but that one brings out the Wii controller I believe um, meanwhile the final one which is it's a secret um, that gives a random weapon and I don't know what all of them are but Pretty much each of those has its own weapon, and my favorite one happens to be the superhero one. <laughs> Freaking have a you wear your own costume with a cape and a mask, and you punch the zombies to death. <laughs> but anyways, I'm ready. That's the spirit. Then it's time to hit the town. Brace yourself. Better brace yourself, though. It's likely to hit back. Welcome to Hobbyville, in Street Pass County. Really? <laughs> it's a vibrant city filled with people who are passionate about their hobbies. Or, at least it was. But yesterday, everything changed. Let me just read this newspaper about Wiimotes and... A sale that's 80% off. Yeah, the M, that M, uh, thing. That's the costume, actually. If you see that as an item, that's like one of my favorite ones. Special attack is lasers and stuff. <laughs> Alright, so... Unlike any of the other games, you can actually move around in this one. Really cool and stuff, like actually being able to move your me around um, so let's get this uh, smartphone and a mysterious vial hello is anyone there uh yeah what a relief I didn't think anyone was going to pick up you said your name was L player right it's good to know that not everyone has been infected yet pardon me for prying but are you impressively well-armed by any chance? Uh, no. No such luck? 
No. No such luck. <laughs> You're just out shopping, you say? Playing video games is all you were thinking about? Got my 3DS right here. My Japanese 3DS playing on that and stuff. <laughs> well, no time to fret about that now. Take a look around you. It's imperative that you find some sort of weapon. Well, I got a Wii remote. You found a Wii remote that someone must have lost on the train. That just got bigger all of a sudden. How did it get on? The freaking train's moving. <laughs> and why was the door open? So yeah, press A to attack. Simple enough. I knew it was only a matter of time till the zombies infested the subway lines. Hmm? How is it that I'm aware of what you just saw? Oh please, that smartphone you've got there is the very latest model. It can tell me all sorts of things. But enough chit chat. We must stay focused. The truth is, something truly terrible has happened. There are zombies everywhere! Okay. I believe I can formulate a cure that'll save the world before it becomes completely overrun. I can't do it alone, though. I need help from someone out in the city. Someone like you. What do you say? Too moved for words? <laughs> Too amazed that fate has drawn us together? Not to worry. I'll take your silence as a yes. Yes. You're me as the silent protagonist. <laughs> oh, but I haven't introduced myself. My name is Dr. Scarlet. I'm a scientist who specializes in unusual pathogens. It's a real stroke of luck, you finding the smartphone I lost on the way to my father's research center. I'll use it to stay in touch with you and keep you posted about things, uh, how things are progressing. For now, please focus on staying alive and on tracking down other survivors. The city is full of people with all sorts of different hobbies. That's it. I'm sure any of you, any you save, will be glad to share their hobby supplies with you. Maybe you can arm yourself that way. A.K.A. why the secret one is random because their secret is in their toy that they are using. <laughs> but I have never gotten the popper or this or actually most of these I don't know if any of these are actually items because but I haven't found all the items to be honest there's still question marks marked down so after all like they say necessity is the mother of invention so let's see you get creative shall we oh wait one more thing before I let you go get creative with how you use any weapons you find too, okay? Try to mix up attacks with a few charge attacks. Yeah, those dots on the corner are charge attacks. To perform a charge attack, hold down A until you charge until the charged attack icon blinks and then release the button. Sounds simple, doesn't it? But there's a catch. You see a weapon can only perform a charged attack a certain number of times. Now enough chit chat. I've really got to get to work. You seem resourceful. I make sure I'm sure you'll manage. I'll call again when your train arrives at the next station. Yeah! Heroic spin attack! Heroic spin attack! Did I just lose my item? And this is the true title screen to the game. And yeah, that first session didn't quite count. Now we're really going to play the game. Um, but this right here is pretty much, it tells you, it's pretty much your bestiary. Um, as well as what kind of weapons there are. So we'll show that after we enter the fray and go through the first level. 
Ah, I see, I see you've managed to make it safely to the subway station. Excellent. The streets are packed with zombies. It's only a matter of time until they find you, so enjoy the cover while you can. Stay underground, find more weapons, and deal with any zombies that are lurking about down there. And keep an eye out for survivors, okay? We're all in this together. Now, let me make this also clear. Um, if you're actually, if you actually own this game, um, the person that street passes with you that also has this game, you can, I don't know if you can take their item, but I know that said person will actually follow you around and stuff. However, that person can eventually actually be turned into a zombie too, and you can save them and stuff by giving them antidote or whatever. But, yeah, and then, um, this game actually does get harder. I'm on the second level, or second area, with, uh, my Japanese one. And two-star missions actually do get a little tougher. It starts getting tougher getting goals and stuff, which goals are awarded with these coins down here, and those coins will let you access uh, certain missions later down the line. Like, I believe the first mission actually requires, first mission that requires coins requires 20 coins, and it's a full-out uh, survival uh, course, so yeah pretty much survive and get as many points as possible I don't think I saw any superheroes sadly <laughs> remember zombies are dangerous so be careful out there don't oh you see that you see those two characters following behind me can collect them and actually get uh, them to follow me I thought I could get away from the zombies if I hid in the station. But there are zombies down here too! You know, you look pretty tough. Is there any chance you could get rid of the zombies in here for me? I think this place could make a nice cozy shelter if it were zombie free. Oh, and please take this. I found it earlier, but I think you'll need it more soon. Yeah, I'll need it more soon. What the hell's that? I've never gotten this before, so... <laughs> This is one of my characters, um, actually it's my Japanese capture device 3DS now, um, and it's on a secret, so I've never had a tablet before. <laughs> actually, no, I thought I had, hmm, weird, whatever. So, yeah, I've never used this item before. What I'm about to say is extremely important, and I only have time to say it once, so please listen carefully, okay? If you take damage from a zombie, your current weapon's gauge up here will decrease. Once a weapon's gauge is empty, you'll fall to pieces. It'll fall to pieces. That's all there is to it. If all your weapons break, you'll have to retreat. Please remember that. When you run out of weapons, it's game over. Defeat all the zombies! Okay, so... Whenever you find survivors who look frightened, be sure to help them out. Scared survivors give you weapons when you rescue them. Those will come in handy as you fight through the stage. Switching between multiple weapons is easy. Press L or R or tap the bottom screen. What the heck's this? Hmm. Maybe that's my... I have no idea. All I know is that I've never used the luggage e either. <laughs> Ah, I see you've located a survivor who is willing to join forces with you. When you encounter people like this, you have a couple different options. You can team up and fight together, or you can ask for a weapon and then they, then send them off to safety. What do you want to do? Team up, of course! You got it! Oh my god, this weapon sucks. Um... Okay, so playing video games, we've already seen this and pretty much, uh... It's a sword. With a spin attack. So think Link. Um, but we can actually team up with them as well. Ah, see the power of the internet. Um, what is this? A ray gun? Did they change the weapons in uh, the Japanese? Or in, uh, or am I just getting all weapons that I haven't 
use yet because I really want that superhero weapon. <laughs> okay, so this is a ray gun. Ooh. And what's this? The okay, I recognize this one. Um, team up two. Yeah. Yeah. Say hello to my Raygon. My Raygon? Did I just say Raygon? Okay, a new tablet and a better one too. You all can keep a. Uh, what the hell? A go kart. Don't. Let... <laughs> okay. Really? Wait, did I... Okay, I was about to say, did... What's this? Okay, so that is a weapon, apparently. So it looks like I'm not gonna get any, uh... Any superhero this time, sadly. I still like my ray gun. Say hello to my little friend. Come out. Come on. Say ya! I think I hurt them a lot. Okay, how many? 29 left. I think my. Oh, right. I don't have. Whoa! No! Give me that! Give me that! Give me that! This makes you invincible and run into zombies and take them out really freaking fast. Come on, where's the last one? Where's the last one? Oh, 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 oh! What? Oh, there's the last one! Okay, we still got... Ow! We still got... A few seconds to kill this thing. Come on. Kill it! Woo! You want to get the... You want to get the time so you get another coin, because... As you'll see down here... Thank you so much! Now that the station's all cleared out, it should be safe to stay here for a while. I mean, assuming there's... There are no zombies on this main... Next train, but... Come on! What are the odds of that happening again? Pretty high. <laughs> Excellent work, but don't get comfy down there. I'm not confident that your present location will be safe for long. Yeah, uh, let me say that I agree, considering there's a big chance that the stream's gonna happen too. I re arranged for a chopper to get you and the other survivors to safety. It'll be landing at the stadium soon. In the meantime, get everyone to the hospital. It should be safe to wait there until the chopper arrives. I'll contact you again as soon as I have more news. Until then, stay safe, okay? You rock! Okay. So... So that is what that freaking... This right here? This right here. I have been dying to know what the heck this one is. And I still have not seen this before so but yeah defeat a rare zombie i have never seen a rare zombie before i have never gotten that achievement on any level yet <laughs> but yeah see all these medals a z wiki as uh oh what am i saying added to the z wiki suitcase wii remote ray gun backpack and robotic pet and go-kart and then we got the Shambler in the bestiary, a Blockhead, a Creepy Courier, and a Mega Shambler. Oh, and the Mega Slimebacker. Bye! You're not coming with me, actually. And then for doing it the first time, I get some tickets! I get a lot of tickets, actually. Actually, I thought I got more than that, but whatever. 
<laughs> yeah, I actually got a Wii remote, and even though I had only one person with me, or I only had uh, one person on the street pass at the time, that sword is overpowered a little bit. <laughs> Or the Wii remotes, a little OP, in my opinion. Especially in that level. Taking out regular zombies is easy with it. Okay, so, ah, I see you found the Z-Wiki app. It's an incredibly handy reference tool. It automatically records useful information about your encounters. It also tracks your progress and lets you adjust a few different settings. Don't just take my word for it, though. Take the Z Wiki for a spin and see what of what it's got to offer. So, rare zombies. Hmm. Yeah, as you can tell, there's 26 of them. Never have ran into one. Um, this tells you the goal. Um, I'm pretty sure one of the goals is uh. That's what it is. The showdowns. You need medals to get the showdowns. Um. Pretty sure one of these is like get a high combo or something because I could swear I got at least two tickets uh, whenever I first did it. So, ranking, rare zombies, settings. Oh. Um, control. Zombification off. How is this off? I could. I don't know, never mind. Um. But yeah, as you can tell, there's 26 different weapons too. Also, it tells you what hobbies the people need to be. So I guess that's a good way to know what your favorite weapon is. And then uh, with that, if you have another 3DS, um, switch your Mii's job to or hobby to that. Um, then it tells you how many of these you've defeated as well. These sometimes hold uh, tickets as well, so be aware of that if you get the game. <laughs> Usually you have to do a certain thing as well to get them to appear. Unless they're with a horde of zombies like what you saw. But, yeah, that's it with Battleground Z. Let me know what you think and your thoughts. And, yeah, I hope you all have a great day and I will catch you all next time.